Titans won Coliseum and XD Remix. That's all I have to say. I mean, you're not wrong. I would it's love, not going to happen. I would want them both. Because, dude, the price for them right now are like $75 to $100 yeah. a pop. Yeah. I, I got them. But, like, but still, that's insane. Ugh. I, can't, I cannot count how many hours I've spent on those two games combined. And the fact that they never got a remake, a re-release, a sequel. Ever? Not, nothing. Never on VC. Ever again. Just deleted from the universe. Bro, they brought Pokemon Snap back. It's 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 time. It's, it's this time. game's turn. It's definitely time. They brought the dude. They brought the friggin' um Shadow Pokemon into Pokemon Go. <sighs> yeah. Okay. Yeah. So what the heck? Like, <laughs> and everyone, dude, anyone that didn't play those games is like, oh, what's your Shadow Pokemon? Oh, but like everyone that played XD and Coliseum is like that. I know what that is. I like that. <sighs> Give oh, me my Shadow know. Lugia. I, yeah, Shadow Lugia and and Primal Dialga. In any form, Sh- Sinnoh remakes or Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Two remakes. I know I won't get both, but if I could just get one, that'd be nice. Just give, you know what? Just give us all the Pokemon stuff. Listen, Please. it's the twenty twenty fifth, right? Twenty fifth. Yeah. Six. So, it's twenty. Just six. give us everything. Yeah, that'd be nice. Pokemon Day. All right, it's ten a.m. It should be starting soon. All right, come on. I'm waiting for it to let me the do the full screen here. I hope this isn't longer than like half an hour because I do got to go to work. Oof. I don't know. It's so weird because they didn't give any accent. They didn't say anything on what they're going to be talking about. Just in the description is just the date and the start time. So nothing. Yeah. Yo, they're fumbling the ball here. Oh. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh we got a countdown oh, for another right, two right. minutes. Ah, right, this is what they do, though. This is what they do. Okay, so, but the thing about this year is that they ha- they're getting involved with all these other, like, music artists, like Post Malone, uh, I think Lady Gaga. Like, it's interesting what they're doing this year. It's weird. It's not very Pokemon company yet. <laughs> like, it's different. Like, are they accepting that they have older, like, fans and it's not just kids? Like, that'd be a nice, like, if you turn the page finally. Imagine, imagine how much money they could make if they could continually resell the same game to their same audience for 25 years. Yo, that's fine. <laughs> Yo, we still buy it! But that's the thing, that's exactly what they did, but they just kept marketing it to a younger and younger and younger audience instead of the same audience they've had the whole time. So now it feels like they're actually doing that, and, like, I don't know. The advertising for Pokemon just seems so different. All right. So one minute. What's the first thing that gets presented? What's the first thing shown? Ah, uh, Pokemon Unite. It's. I think it's gonna be Unite or Snap. I don't think they'll open with anything new. I think it's gonna be like, no. okay, get that no, no, no. all the way. Oh, I close, like Snap. They close with the big announcement. That's what's gonna happen. Uh, Diamond Pearl remake, or are we getting Let's Go Hoenn? Or are we getting more DLC for Sword and Shield? I see. I think they should keep going DLC with Sword and Shield. I don't think it's time for a new gen. Like I think I, I was saying, I think we need to get two more rounds of DLC for Sword and Shield that add in the whole Pokedex. Oh, get, yeah, the whole national Pokedex. That should be the or goal. Or we get Sinnoh Remix. That's it. We have to get one of those two. Oh, I I. <sighs> I just, I want them to keep using Sword and Shield as a platform, so if they keep adding DLC, it's fine. But I, I like the idea of the remakes and them being able to bring them over to Sword and Shield. But they need to up the competitiveness in Sword and Shield if they're going to do it. They need to make it better. All right, here we go. Here, right, here we, we go. go. Here we 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 go. 10 out of 10. Yes. Red, green, cable. Oh, I think they're gonna announce the game. This is what they do. Oh, oh okay, yeah, okay. Oh, let's <laughs> let's just load it that way. Fine. Oh my god, what a pull! Yo, if if they're showing this, what if like they just said that now all this is available today on like Virtual Console? I pull myself. Yo, oh my god, I remember oh my god. that. The OG Pokemon. Oh. Uh, give me that pinball. <gasps> the blockbuster printing! Oh. Stop, this is a nostalgic trip of it. Man. Training card. Anime. Crystal. Mobile 
<laughs> that was only in Japan. That's not even fair. Oh my god. Oh my god, the e reader. Oh my boy. My boy's <laughs> right here. Still cables. I'm, I'm waiting for that wireless adapter. With SP. There we go. Ah! There it is! Yo, just. We're gonna see, uh, uh, what's, what's the title? Uh, Conquest. Let's go. Oh my god, what the heck? Oh my god. Oh. 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 Oh, yo, I saw Pokemon Ranger. Oh my god. Ugh. Yo, I love that game. Oh my oh, god, Paul. why is it buffering so oh hard? God. It's bad right now. <laughs> oh, good luck. Yo, I'm gonna get mad. Rotation rotation the rotation battles are actually hurting. Oh my, please. Please, YouTube, stop. I'm gonna. Oh my god. Alright, come on. Movie. <laughs> Wait, that's the first time they ever said the movie. Are you kidding me? No, they said movie a couple times. Did they? Okay. Yeah. Like for the original one. Yo, this is getting annoying. Oh my god. Please. I'm surprised they brought up the type of Yes. I kind of want to refresh to see if it works better. I think you're ahead of other people. Though. I think we're good. Oh but, my this God. Whole, but this is what I mean every couple seconds. It's no good. Yo, Pokemon Company doesn't like to have the direct link. <laughs> Yo, Pokemon tournament was mad fun. Please. You know, it's kind of cool to see like all the technology change. Yeah. Oh, come on. But like since the very, very beginning, yeah. <laughs> but trading cards didn't change. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, it's not lagging now. Good. Yeah, uh, well, don't, <laughs> don't say it. God, see what you did! Oh my god, no! <laughs> no, what did I do? Oh my god. I actually want one of those. I would do those. I would do that. I love them. mad expensive, though. That's a problem. Excuse me, they should just said Ryan Reynolds. Oh, oh, that's 2019, uh, right, bro. Hold, hold on. on. Hmm. It's like clench. What? Wait, is that actually a thing? <laughs> yes, yes, that's the thing. Uh, Alright, so no Twilight. Alright, alright, what, what? Excuse me? We're doing a VR fest? The virtual concert? Oh my god! What do you mean we're going to Wait, space? Oh, excuse me? <laughs> no, bring it back! What the hell is that? Oh, no! I saw XD! I saw Rudy Cole oh, using Hydro my... Pump and XD! Oh no! Dude, those Pokemon oh stones look god. sick! Hold on! Oh! There we Oh my god. Go oh, that was 2014 with Sacred Park using Pastor Isu. Dude, this is so awful. Um, I wanna know, I wanna know the outer space. What, what's, uh... Yo, we get real Pokeballs. They're just spawning Pokemon now. <laughs> in IRL. 
Or what do they got? What kind of sauce do they have? Hello, everyone. Oh, Junichi Masuda. Shihara from the Pokemon Company. Oh, never mind. <laughs> <laughs> February 27th is the date Pokemon Red and Pokemon Green were released in Japan. <laughs> is marking that... the beginning of the never Pokemon mind. series. <laughs> All right. Yo, I still want those boxes in person. 25 Ugh. years have passed since the Pokemon series was born. We've shared so much with you over the past 25 years, through our games, but also through so many other mediums, thanks to the support you've all shown us. Thank you, each and every one of you. Today, Mr. Utsunomiya will introduce our latest updates. Okay. Hello there, my name is Utsunomiya from the Pokemon Company. First, I'd like to give you the latest update on the new Pokemon Snap game. Do you see that? Right behind you to the right. Do you, you see that? Uh, Please have a look. Uh, it's the Gallard starters and then the Sinnoh starters. <laughs> Wait a minute. Wait a... No. Wait, it, no, it's not happening. All right. Well, I see. Okay, okay I said we were going to do Snap. They, they want to get over... Like, I, I, I... That's what I thought. I, I figured that the they want to get over the hump of... Pokemon of, like, Snap. This showing what was old region. and, like, that's coming out, like, You'll ride the Neo 1 through the jungle... I'm not gonna lie though, I'm so excited for this now. Under the sea I do actually, I, I haven't bought a game for the Switch since Animal Crossing came out. I, yeah. I'm like, and of course, you won't be alone. I'm 100% doing this. I, I love in the lentil region, snap. And research team members Rita and Phil are there to support you. So you're in good hands. Now then, let's get that research started. Ugh. By watching wild Pokemon, you can discover behaviors and expressions that are rarely seen. <laughs> Look! A surfing Alolan Raichu! Okay, throwing it And there's Vaporeon! Let's try We got the apples, fruit. let's go! That's it! Now's our chance! Oh, God. Oh. oh, it's Tyranitar! Oh, my big boy! <laughs> Yo. A wild way to eat. <laughs> Yo, that's how you choke! Here's a park at night. No, that pincer's not Let's blue. I don't want to look at it. Oh my god, if they could do shinies. Oh, that sure oh, made Hoot Hoot happy. You'll also have Illumina orbs, something the professor invented. What? If you use one of these, you can make any Pokemon glow. Um. Okay. Whoa, those flames changed color. Look at that hitbox. <laughs> Make good use of your tools <laughs> and that really stand out. Did you just see him fly, no. bro? Show the photos you took he to took the professor. <laughs> oh, four stars. Fly? We captured a rare moment there. Oh my god. Catch a variety All right, of different ooh, behaviors so I, I like that on camera it's, it's to basically fill the up same your Pokemon photo decks. Yeah. For and games. there's more. <gasps> You'll be able to edit the photos well, you've no, taken. Sir. No way. You're getting too hyped. Use flex. features like stickers and frames right, I don't to make need your stickers. favorite photos even more special. Oh, no, I need stickers. And I'm oh sure God. you'll want to show off <laughs> your Kangas best Kang. photos, right? I we wouldn't know say I love Kangas Kang that well. much, but I do love Kangas. When you want to do that, it's time to go online. You can share your favorite photos and check out photos from around the world. And if your photo <laughs> okay, becomes all right. popular, <laughs> Wait, it might awesome. even be <laughs> featured and get more attention. Seeing something like that may inspire you to go back and take even more photos. We're getting closer to the start of your adventure. Unexplored islands and plenty of Yo, Pokemon for real, await that last in the lentil region. Food. So make sure you're oh, prepared. Oh, they're using Harden. The Metapod, they're using Harden. I love it. Whoa! Is that the mythical Pokemon oh, Celebi? Oh, uh oh. Look at Celebi. Get ready. The lentil region is waiting for you. The lentil region? Wait a minute. Isn't that a bean? <laughs> All okay. right. All right get, we'll get, get Unite out of the way. I hope you're looking forward to the game's release on April 30th. Yeah, bro. Next, I'd like to tell you about several events we're holding to celebrate Pokemon Day. In the Pokemon Sword oh? and Pokemon Shield games, Special Max Raid Battles featuring Gigantamax Pikachu are underway. And in Pokemon Cafe Mix, we're holding a promotion in which you can receive 2,500 Golden Acorns for logging in. In Pokemon Go, Articuno, Zapdos, Moltres, okay. and even Mewtwo are appearing in Legendary Raid Battles as part of a Kanto-themed celebration event. Fine. 
Those are the only Pokemon I'm Pokemon missing from Masters Pokemon Go. So I should probably do that. Oh, Leon I forgot about Masters Pokemon Pokemon Charizard will arrive at last. I play too many other gacha games. We I don't hope need you'll enjoy one. these events. <laughs> Next, I'd like to present the latest news about the Pokemon video game series. Have what? Look at this video. Hold on. What? Hold no. On. Dude, oh, no, no, it's not happening. Buckle up. No way. Here we go. Is it happening? Um. They said the main series. Okay. Wait, wait, all right, oh, we're gonna get a remake! Oh, oh no! No, oh, it's happening! No, it's happening! <laughs> wait, there's a DI! It's a DI! <laughs> 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 It is time! No way! Oh my god! It's happening! Oh my god! They're actually doing it! I can't... Oh. Oh my god, we've waited long enough! Wait, is it gonna be Let's Go or like a real remake? Oh! What? What is this? What? Whoa! Whoa! Wait a minute, it's back into the, the grid style! Oh. Alright, so real remake. Real oh remake! Oh my god! Oh my god, it's Yo. beautiful! So it's like it looks like they combined the two almost. Oh my god! This is beautiful. Please. Oh wow, they're like super chibi. Oh my god! Oh my god, the underground! Cricketoon! <laughs> Oh god. Okay. Cool. Yeah. Alright, so this here. Finally. And they're not Finally. slapping let's go on it. We asked. We asked and we shall receive. I don't think that's it. Oh my god, stop! Wait, no, wait. Platinum? No. No. No wait. What? Are we, wait, are we going really next gen? This is a tale from a long, long Conquest? time ago. What? When the Sinnoh region was still only a vast wilderness. What? A certain village bustled with the comings and goings of people. While in the mountains and seas, Pokemon roamed as they pleased. What? What's going on? What? What? Whoa! Is that Mount Coronet? Whoa! <gasps> Yo, what am I looking at? We're going back in time. Oh, this, Please, oh, the lagging. buffer, this is horrible. Whoa. I have so built off of the sword and shield engine. Oh my god, they finally they fig oh they made the grass look good. <gasps> what? What? What's happening? What's going on? Yo, she just yoinked that thing. Rhyhorn? I don't. What is going on? I don't even. Yo, is this? All right, so they early development. No way is it this year, this year. What am I looking Wait, at? Wait, are you just having like natural Pokemon battles in the wild? Like it's not. Oh. Excuse me. Are you giving me Sword and Shield Pokemon? Or, not Sword and Shield, Breath of the Wild Pokemon? What are these starter choices? What's going on? What? Wait, why Rowlet, Syndicate, and Oshawa? What's going on? Are we just not gonna talk about it? Are we doing something what? new now? What's happening? What is. What is that? Please, this buffering. Is that Arceus? It's, it's buffering, but is that Arceus? Yeah. Yeah! Yeah. Yo, Arceus is gonna bring us the virtual council. What is going on? Excuse Legends? me? Legends? Yeah, okay, that's what I thought. Oh. I, so. What am I looking at? It, it looked what like. I'm pleased to announce two new additions to the Pokemon video game series. Both to Please. Bruh. 
taking place in the Sinnoh region. First, I'd like to present the Pokemon Brilliant Diamond and Pokemon Shining Pearl games. These are faithful remakes of the Pokemon Diamond version and Pokemon Pearl version games, which were released for the Nintendo DS system in Japan 15 years ago. Oh my god. I mean, this is so cool that they're doing like a full, like, real remake. We the asked Pokemon for Brilliant for Diamond and Pokemon Shining Pearl games remakes of the Pokemon Diamond version and Pokemon Pearl version yeah, It looks like the games which were released for the Nintendo DS I'm not hard style. Yeah. are coming yeah, to Nintendo Switch. The These games will be developed by Ilka Inc. who also Ilka? worked on Pokemon Home. The project oh. is being directed by Yuichi Ueda of Ilka as well as Game Freak's Junichi Masuda, who was the director for the original Pokemon Diamond version and Pokemon Pro version games. Your adventure will take it's place in the Sinnoh region, that branching out to rich other in companies nature to do and the with remakes. towering Mount Coronet like at its heart. That means uh, that Legends is probably taking up it the whole development It is a land of team. many myths passed yeah. down through the ages. The sense of scale of the original game's towns and roots has been carefully preserved, and you'll be able to travel through familiar locations once again. You'll set out on your journey this reminds after me of, uh, choosing the art either Turtwig, for, what, Chimchar, or Piplup as your first it. partner like, Pokemon. Yeah. That's what it looks like. In these games, you can enjoy a grand adventure together with all the Pokemon from Pokemon Diamond version and Pokemon Pearl version. Newcomers and previous visitors to the Sinnoh region alike can look forward to experiencing the original Pokemon Diamond and Pokemon Pearl stories, freshly recreated for oh. Nintendo Switch. The more I see, the less I'm into it. <laughs> I mean, this is this is to be expected, though. Like, no matter what they gave us for the Diamond and Pearl remakes, people were going to be upset. But, like, it is Diamond and Pearl well, remakes, did you think? so, yeah. like, I'm happy. Pokemon I'm Brilliant happy. Diamond and Pokemon Shining Pearl will launch simultaneously around the world late this year. We hope you're all excited for a nostalgic yet fresh adventure in the Sinnoh region. I mean, it's still day one, bye. Next, allow me to introduce you to the Pokemon Legends Arceus game. Yeah, tell, tell Pokemon me more, Legends please. Arceus represents a new approach for the Pokemon video game <laughs> series. Development is in full swing at Game Freak, with the aim yep. to deliver a gaming experience that breaks new ground for the Pokemon series. Please have a look at this video. <laughs> The events of this game unfold in the Sinnoh of old. In this time, too, Mount Coronet towers over the Please. the center of the region. Pokemon live freely in the wild here, but the harsh environments may be different from the Sinnoh region you remember. Oh my god. For the love of god. In this era, People have journeyed to Sinnoh from all over and founded a prosperous village in the hope of learning more about this land. As for these three Pokemon, Rowlet, Cyndaquil, and Oshawott, it seems they were brought to Sinnoh by a certain professor who encountered them while traveling around various regions. Are You'll you set off on your adventure after receiving a first partner Pokemon of your own from this professor. What? Wild choices. With a village as your gonna go with Cyndaquil. Base, you I mean, venture uh, out to no, the different corners no of the region on your quest to create Sinnoh's very first Pokedex. What? Even in this era, wild Pokemon can be caught with Pokeballs. You can also engage in Pokemon battles alongside your Pokemon allies. Yo, if that changes Sharpen every time you do an encounter. your skills for both catching and battling Pokemon, and strive to complete your Pokedex. Now for the mythical Pokemon that graces the game's title and story, Arceus. According to legend, Arceus shaped... Uh, excuse oh me? Oh my god. Um. Um, help? <laughs> um... <laughs> What happened? Yo, they uh, stopped it. <laughs> what? Why? Um, hello? What? Nintendo, please. Yeah, no, it's it, done.
Your Pokemon Hello? allies. Yeah, oh. <laughs> no, like, I'm trying. It's gone. <laughs> you wanted to see cool information, kids? Too bad. What the hell is going on? Arceus broke the internet. Oh my, what the heck? And there's not even live chat, so I can't see everyone else spamming. It's broke. Yo, we gonna, we gonna. Nintendo Switch system. Oh my god, what happened? Hold on. Wait, I pulled it up on you. We're back. We are back. We back. I think. Pokemon Legends Arceus will launch simultaneously around the world early next year. Great. We hope you're all excited to set out on these adventures across the Sinnoh region, each one distinctly different from the other, with the wonderfully nostalgic Pokemon Brilliant Diamond and Pokemon Shining Pearl, as well as the Pokemon video game series New Journey, Pokemon Legends Arceus. So is Arceus going to be like an actual new gen or no? As Pokemon celebrates 25 years, I, we will continue to challenge know. ourselves and deliver new ways for everyone to enjoy Pokemon even more. Thank you very much for watching. All right. Hold on. All right. So I'm going to go back then if that's the end. If that's the end. Hold on. Hold on. Hold up. As for these. Moving up. Era. Wild Pokemon. Move up. Nope. All right. Now for the mythical Pokemon oh, that graces missed. the game's we title and story, bit. Arceus. According to legend, Arceus shaped all there is in this world. But how is this Pokemon connected to your journey? The answer to this question and more awaits you in this exciting new action RPG adventure for oh, the Nintendo dude, Switch system. Dude, he's just gonna snake yeah. dash attack. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I mean, if this world is actually that big, that's pretty cool. Okay. Pokemon Legends Arceus will launch simultaneously. All right. that's the so, end. That's the end. yeah, that's the end, the end. That's it? That's all they showed us? I mean, I mean all, right, all, right, all right, I say that's it. It is the Diamond and Pearl remix. That we got, yeah, I was about to say, we got the remake everyone world. wanting, and then they dropped this, like, Pokemon Legends Arceus. Like, does that mean we're going to go to different legendary Pokemon throughout, like, the series? But, like, I, I don't get it. This it's is so, so weird. Out there. Like it nothing about it makes any sense. Like they picked random starters like I do I don't even know. It's, I don't know what to make of that. No, I I and it'd be weird if they were going to introduce new Pokémon in the region cuz like this is the region's history, quote unquote, right? So it's oh. like uh big brain Pokemon company here. I mean, it looks cool, though. And the fact that, like, those battles, it, it looks like they weren't just, like, staged environments, like how your traditional battle system is. So it looks like wherever you're yeah. walking, like, alright, now you're gonna fight in that space. Which and, is cool. Um, I'm gonna play devil's advocate here for a second and, and, and say what everyone's gonna be saying on Twitter all night. Why aren't the Diamond and Pearl remakes in the same style as that game? Um... But, I, just, I mean, they, resources. They, There's no way they were gonna do do it that way because I think that, that's why faithful to the original. Which okay, okay, I get it. It's just I don't know. They have it looks like they have the resources to make one big game that looks like in the style of you know this Legends game. So I don't. know, Maybe that's what we're in store for for Generation Nine. <sighs> I just imagine the, the graphics, that'd be so long to do though, right? Like I feel the like graphics the... in that looked. So so much better than Sword and Shield. So much better. Well, that and they have... I, I'm I'm trying to think of like how long they might have been doing development for now Pokemon Legends, uh, which is so weird. I don't get... It It feels so weird to have like that name. Like I feel like it's going to be like its own now different series of going to like previous uh, regions like in history. Yeah. But, I mean, that's the opportunity. It's just... I don't know. It's weird. Uh, Joe in chat is just going, ah, Diamond and Pearl, and then Big Facts. Big facts, Joe. <laughs> I just this in chat is for you, bro. Yo, Legends is so weird. I mean, it's cool. I, I like it. It's the first time Pokemon's going back in time. It's always felt like it progressed. So it's interesting to see. And I wonder how, like, are they? Is this their way of moving on from Sword and Shield? I don't think so. I think this is. I think this is a sneak peek at the next, the next, next generation of Pokemon. Cause this is insane. Ah, oh, I, I just like I said, this being able to encounter like that is cool. Uh, some of the animations obviously looked derpy when like you're throwing the Pokemon ball, like 
the animation of the Pokemon getting hit, like it was very static. Uh, yeah, even Jones had Legend looks weird, but I like it. I I think that's the consensus here. It's like it's different, but I'm okay with it. <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna also, have to rewatch this trailer about forty times. They didn't to, show uh, really unite that. at all. Yeah, they like, eh. I, I, I felt like they went into depth with the Sinnoh stuff, which I mean, all right, you're like, yeah, that's kind of what you're supposed to do when you make the remake games, but I don't know. They they really only showed three games. I and guess then they, had, they had that really big tribute at the beginning, and like that was cool. Yo, like, I, was I love seeing those tributes. It's such a trip. And I just, I wanted them just to say, hey, for the backlog behind Diamond and Pearl or whatever, it's like, this is all on VC now. Like, yeah. why can't we do that? Like, you, you you just poured it. just You did it for the 3DS. Like, come yeah. on. So, I mean, you know, like I said, Pokemon fans are going to be upset with no matter what they release. But all in all, I think, um, I think this was pretty good. I think we got about as much and as good as we could have expected. Yeah. I mean, it's. I guess this the design choice for Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl is interesting. Yeah. Uh, but it'll be interesting. At, at least, you know, we're getting Pokemon this year, and then we have Legends for next year. So, that's a lot. Yeah, we also get Pokemon Snap in a few months. So, Which yeah. is hype. Yep. Yeah. Alright, well, I'm gonna take off. I gotta get ready for work. Um, I'll be watching the Post Malone concert <laughs> tomorrow night. Hell yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right. Hey, thanks for hanging out with me, bud. Yeah, man, this is pretty fun. All right, see ya. All right, chat. Very interesting of stuff that's happening with Pokemon. Brilliant Diamond, Shining Pearl, getting Pokemon Le I still gotta say, Pokemon Legends looks just different. It's but like good different. Like look at look at this. If you're battling and you're just walking in the environments and like that's when you encounter, like that's interesting. Uh, also, they're bringing those swipes back. Uh, like, that little design piece is interesting. And, like, they're trying to make it cinematic, like, where they're putting in the bar. Like, oh, interesting thematic designs, but I wonder how big the environment's actually going to be. Like, do you get pigeonholed there going to Mount Coronet? Like, what's, uh, what's, what's the deal? What's the deal? And we don't know what's going on with Arceus. But the style looks cool. Obviously, it's built from the Sword and Shield engine. Or whatever they were basing it off. And, right? The fact that you could snipe Pokemon without having to battle. It's so interesting. So, th there's a lot of question marks. I'm willing to bet we'll see it at E3. We're going to see more stuff about it. <clears throat> uh, I don't think they'll spend a lot more time on the Diamond and Pearl remakes in the future. Just because it's kind of obvious on what they are. Uh Interesting choice of design. Uh, I wasn't expecting them to go more of like that chibi route. I was hoping that they would stay more close to the original design than that. I mean, it's fine. I'll still play it. It's still day one buy. I get it. But like, I wasn't thinking a link between worlds or or Link's Awakening. There we go. I didn't think they were gonna go with that art style. But it's fine. The Pokemon looked actually pretty good. The models still look good. So minor grievances, if you would. But it's very interesting on what the Pokemon company is doing. And the fact that the Pokemon company is branching out to more and more companies to actually build the brands more. Like I said, it was like Ryan that doing Pokemon Unite. You have Legends Arceus as their main title at Game Freak. And then they branched out to the other company who did Pokemon Home uh, to do the remix, which is interesting. I'm surprised that they went to... Yeah, like even that company, like it, it just sounds like what... It doesn't make sense. I don't know what that company's history is other than doing Pokemon Home. So, who knows? Uh, yeah, no, I... I, <laughs> I, I like that, Joe. Just, it, it looks pretty good. It, it's like, it's just... it's. I guess it's just getting used to, right? It feels like I'm on the old man on the podium. You changing my Pokemon! And it's, <laughs> it's just different. But I think overall, these two announcements of getting the remakes and the remakes coming out this year, so... Holiday season is going to be bumping. And then we start in like quarter one, like early 2022. So that's probably quarter one. They don't want to guarantee it just because of pandemic, like with how the development is. But so quarter, like that is going to be insane for the amount of Pokemon that's coming out this year and leading into next year. I still hope 
that they continue maybe some more DLC for Sword and Shield. I think their objective for Sword and Shield is to get to National Dex level and then build off of that platform to be able to move forward. I like that they didn't just say, hey, let's make a new generation of Pokemon and just kind of keep pushing it instead of like, all right, let's make that base better. Let's get that National Dex in and let's then move forward from that point. I hope that's the plan at Game Freak. I'm hope, or it's just like, it needs to be. I, I don't want them to just rush, like, all right, let's do a new gen, and, like, here's new things, and it's like, no, f- fix it, make make things better. And I'm just reading through, so curious if there's something else added to the remakes. Auras had the Delta episode, the Ultra Games had wormholes. And you know what, there has to be, well, they did say it's a faithful remake, and they stressed it, so I don't know if they would add more content. I think they should. I think, like, yeah, adding in, like, another, like, Delta episode-esque level to the game would be nice because you knew Oras was different like it was still telling like okay yeah same region but it felt like it was still a little bit different with story whereas like these Diamond and Pearl remakes is like pretty faithful remakes so I'm gonna go maybe on that uh I it'd be nice if they do it I think it would be worth it for the players who would be going back to it as a remake versus the players who would be exposed to it for the first time just to add that little extra piece so it makes sense but a lot of cool stuff today. A lot of cool things coming from Pokemon. This initial like this initial opening of going through like the twenty five years of Pokemon was so cool, and uh, they were just hitting on all the titles. Uh, they didn't do the original board game, which is <laughs> the original Master Quest. I guess they want to burn that in the fire. That's all right. Yo, <laughs> faithful in the sense of no fire types too. Oof. Coming out of the fire there, Joe. But, alright guys, I'm going to wrap it up here. Because I could just talk the day away of literally of uh, the same thing over and over and over. But I hope you guys all at least had something you were able to look forward to in this Pokemon Presents. I know tomorrow we got that Pokemon concert with Post Malone. Getting that new Pokemon <laughs> signal. I don't know what world and what timeline we're on. Well, thank you guys all for hanging out. Thank you, Joe, for chatting it up. And I will hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day.